end of July and beginning of August is going to be visited by this guy. Mr. Pop-Up Thunderstorm has his work cut out for him. So, Mr. Pop-Up Thunderstorms, I'm not going to keep you here that long. So, because you're going to be quite busy throughout this week. So, you can, you can go ahead. We'll see you plenty more after this week. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. All chances for some pop-up thunderstorms. Most of them saying 30% chance. Friday, a little bit more as well. So what you kind of want to do is just bear down and buckle through because we have low 90s. With the humidity up, it's going to feel a little bit warmer than that as well. And most of those storms and rain chances are going to be coming through during the heat of the, heat of the day. Around 4, 5, 6, that kind of area. Not everyone's going to see one, but we will see some. You get to see those picturesque kind of cumulonimbus clouds coming across the sky and some flashes of lightning as well so definitely want to be careful and weather wise and drink plenty of water i know people are getting ready to get back into the work swing get back into school as well getting your kids or yourself ready for school and classes so it's gonna be a hot and humid start to august i know what they used to say when i went to college that hottest day is moving day so plan accordingly. Uh, I can't even remember when move-in day was. I know it's coming up soon, so drink plenty of water if you're moving into your new place or walking to class or just going to work. Either one, make sure to drink plenty of water because it will feel warmer than low 90s. And, of course, have that umbrella nearby just in case you're one of the unlucky few to get caught in that 30 per chance pop-up thunderstorms. And you get to see a visit from Mr. Pop-Up Thunderstorms. So make sure to stay weather-wise with those heat and humidity coming through this week and make sure to have a great day and a better tomorrow.